Stray and neglected animals now have a new beginning in Transylvania County. As News 13's John Lee reports, our person of the week was a key player in building a state-of-the-art shelter that's long overdue. Well, today we got a sneak peek of the brand new Transylvania County Animal Shelter. This is the cat room right here. You could say this place looks like a million bucks. Well, actually, it looks like 1.1 million bucks. And it couldn't have been possible without one man who spearheaded efforts to rally the community. It was one of the best things that could have ever happened to me. If you could read between the lines, you'd learn so much about Dr. Clyde Brooks. Would you like for me to tell you the story? Full-time veterinarian, part-time author, animal lover 24-7. He penned the book Sir Hopsalot to give kids a sense of compassion when it comes to people with disabilities. And this is just to help them see that everyone is very special in God's eyes. That's the house, or rather the yard, where I used to live. And it takes a special kind of humanity to nurture a cause like Dr. Brooks has. There's a lot of animals out there that just need a home. The animal school actually come in. Brooks and County Manager Artie Wilson shows us why they're on the verge of a storybook ending and a new beginning with a new shelter. These are called like guillotine doors. We kind of went to a lot of different animal shelters to look to see how we would do this. The new Transylvania County shelter is nine years in the making. We would not have had this animal shelter if it hadn't been for Dr. Brooks and the Friends of the Animal Shelter because the commissioners had basically told us 750000 was the bottom line that the county was going to put in. That was $350,000 short of what the facility would cost. As chairman of Friends of the Animal Shelter, Dr. Brooks led the fundraising drive. Altogether, we had 850 identifiable donors, and some of those were from outside of this county. In fact, a lot of them were from outside this county. And so everything from a dollar up to much, much, much more. Without his persistence in this, we would not have had it. And then it's exhausted. Each cat cage has this uh, exhaustion right here. So it pulls all the odors out. Dr. Brooks says the county should be proud. It shows that this county really does care about the stray, the neglected, and abandoned animals. And it's going to increase the adoption rate. And I would go through it all over again for what I have now. The moral to the story is simple, showing us what can happen when a community comes together. The end. It's not a drab shelter. There are splashes of color at every turn here at the Transylvania County Animal Shelter. There's a dedication ceremony planned Saturday at 11 a.m. In Transylvania County, I'm John Lee, News 13.